Welcome back, everyone, to Hearts of Iron 4, Home of the Brave Mod. I'm your host, Mr. Mr. Mocha Lover. I don't want to use any sort of special name or any sort of adjective in front of my name before we talk about good old DC Stevenson and the old K -K -K Clan faction. So, uh, let's take a look. We got, we're seeking quite a few things. We've maybe lost a few things here and there. So, in this episode, it is our goal to, well, pretty much put an end to anyone who wants influence within... The Americas, because Americas, well, they're supposed to be ours. This is the second Manifest Destiny, and by gosh, we shall have it. But let's go and do a focus first. Let's see, what do we have? And I do want to f finish as much of the focus tree as possible, especially the unique uh, other stuff. I think I did the Quebec issue, or Consolidate Southern Holdings, so if you like to read about this, go right ahead. So, uh, there. And I'll get to the comments once we do some more of this stuff first. So we did all this, which is great. We could do the goddess of the wickedness of Eve. Let's do some criminal syndicalism. The future of syndicalism and longism has been decided. Labor re-education internment camps are have been authorized by the shell of a Congress to house suspected syndicalists indefinitely until the national emergency of the Civil War is truly ended. The American Legion has already begun to clear meeting houses and city halls or city councils of traitors. More political, slightly more political power, resource efficiency gain, lose some monthly population, get more construction speed, lack of resources, spending goes down by 5%, which is interesting. I don't think I've really ever seen that before. And more factory output. Ah, yes. Purging them, even though they already have been all purged. But you know what? Sometimes we might just need a second purge. And what are we missing for ships? Or what's outdated? Some good stuff. Whatever. Cool. So we're going to try to invade these guys. We're going to do our best. Hopefully we're going to get sunk on the way over there. But we'll see what happens. Hopefully we can do well. We do have a single nuke, which I'm also just going to auto-deploy to put off Prince and see what happens. And, oh, that's kind of hot. And we're still just struggling down here as well, but you know what? What else is new? I'm probably going to struggle down there the entire time. And we've got guys moving around through here. So South America is going to be a pain in what we call the booty. But it is what it is. And and casualties, casualties. Nine and a half million versus a quarter million for us. Not bad. Oh, beautiful. Keep sinking everything they got. Oh, oh god, that's not good. Oh, they actually caught, caught our guys trying to invade. That sucks. That really sucks. Do we not have naval supremacy here? How do we not have naval supremacy? I mean, we got we got our destroyers here who, who do have anti-sub stuff, so... If we lose a few divisions, you know, it is what it is. There's not really much I can do about it, so... Help out if you can. Uh, if you do that, that'd be great. I'll come see the light of day. That'd be good. We're slowly winning here. If not, I don't mind doing this again. Hopefully we don't nuke our own soldiers, though. That's my one of my biggest fears. There you go. We should be able to win right now. Yeah. There's only 26% of their strength left, which is good. And Pulto Prince is ours. And there they go. Oh, we just straight up annexed him. Great. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Decent powered engine. Not bad, not bad. Oh, what is that? Even better depth charges? We could actually probably really use those, so. Uh, good. And now we got to invade over here, too. You guys are headed down here, doing a great job. I don't want to send too many guys down here because supply is, as you can tell, really, really bad. Fade to Cuba. Nope. Ours. As it should be. Alright, so you guys send half you guys over. We're going to naval invade Puerto Rico because... Why not? You guys looking pretty destroyed, but whatever. And after that, we'll probably just invade right there. It won't really matter. Get two guys doing that. More than fine with me. We got another nuke. We only have 59 nuclear reactors. Not enough. Never enough. Well, one of the comments from yesterday's video was someone recommended that we should try and play in this mod, really cause a redux. As it, play as a Central American nation, any single one of them, and reunify Central America. Wholly under one empire. Or, you know, one nation. So, maybe someday. Uh, I'm not opposed to that. Actually, I would like to get more and more involved. Oh, you guys are looking god awful. More and more involved into Kaiser Redux. Wow, that looks really bad. <laughs> that looks really, really bad. Holy cow. But anyways, but yeah, I will. Uh, we will eventually. Amazon's not looking too bad. Not too bad. That's a problem with being tactical bombers. I mean, yeah, they got a lot of extra range, but their support is so not good. Just so not good. Uh, we need to move our ships out a little bit more so we can encompass more areas here. This is going okay. It's not great. Of course, these guys got to hurry the heck up with trying to take a couple of these states here. But we're lacking probably a few tanks here and there. 1.2 million infantry commit. Yeah, medium tanks. Definitely not looking good right now. 
Could use a few more factories too. Are we building any more factories? Hopefully, got some coffee here too to keep us nice and warm. Uh, somewhat, somewhat. We could use more though. Always could use more military factories. Boom, 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 boom. There you go. The four states. Place. Very good. You guys are good to go. Well, let's try. Even though you guys aren't looking very good. Um. Oh, wrong one. I got a couple more days. Criminalized syndicalism, that's a good idea. Nonconformist regulations. The time of allowing Catholics, Jews, Unitarians, Agnostics, Atheists, Mormons, Orthodox believers, and liberal Christians reap the benefits of our people while destroying them is over. No longer may those faiths listed as hostile to America publicly assemble to more than 20 at a time, except in a lot of day of worship, and they will pay special fines for living on our land. Wow. Kind of crazy, but you know what? Let's enjoy it. I guess we got rid of the Constitution a while ago. It is what it is. All right, San Juan. If you don't comply, we will bomb you. Oh, we need some more strategic bombers, huh? See what happens. Our guys... Well, they're actually over there, huh? Okay. Oh, can we bomb over here? Wait, that actually might be relatively okay. No, it doesn't look like we can. Well, uh, how unfortunate. I'm going to bomb this. Oh, I can't bomb it here. I would like to take this tile, just because, even though it's over a river, um, I want to clear them out so we can invade. Oh, that did nothing. That literally did nothing. Can you guys actually win here? Man, nukes are so pathetic in this game. Or the, not, it's not even the mod. It's just a game itself. Hold. Get these guys, and we'll cut them off somewhat. Hold the line. Hold the line. Oh, come on, come on. Look how weak they are. Divisions can literally die to a, due to attrition, so that's good to know. I don't want to nuke my own soldiers. We should be in there, like, right now. Okay, that looks pretty bad. So, go and help out. Help out. Good. Come on. I don't want to have to keep nuking this. Doesn't make any sense. Help out. Crush them. Seriously, they should not be able to defend like this at all. How many more nukes do I need to send to you? There you go, good. Come on. Get in there. You should have already been in there by now, but whatever. There we go, there we go. No, 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 no. There should... Yeah, they should not be able to break us out of there. That was That's complete BS. That's good. That's actually very, very good. You guys are struggling definitely right now, so you guys all are going to hold... Hold the line, and we'll start setting up some more naval invasions, too. So, You guys did a great job over here. Come over to here. Very good, very good. And you guys just make your way down to here. Very good. Have some coffee. Enjoy it together. I mean, I've nuked a lot of guys. We killed off two, 10 million of them. while taking 300,000 casualties. Not great, but not bad. Hey, good. Let them kill each other off. I like that. I like that a lot. Now, it would be much... Uh, I'd love to nuke this, but we can't nuke it because, well, we only have one nuke. But we need more air superiority. Which is fine, whatever. We could probably get some more. That's already maxed out. Wow. Um, yeah, duplicate it. Get over here. That'd be good. Uh, actually, no. We're not going to do that. There you go. More research. Let's grab some of this. More attacks, please. Thank you. And actually, we have better destroyers, right? Senegambia. Don't really care. Light ships, modern ships, good, good, good. So, now, torpedo tubes we gotta edit, that's not bad. Better depth charges, yes, finally. Oh, we don't have enough for that. Oh, that sucks. Um, do that for now, We're not, I don't want to do anything else for them for, for right now. Escort patrols, not bad, not bad. Let's grab some even better dis destroyer stuff, that'd be good. Can you guys, oh my goodness, that's a lot of lag. Okay, I get the idea, guys, I, I seriously get the idea, please stop it. Oh my god, stop calling in so many people. This is why I don't like Kaiser Egg sometimes. Oh my... I, the game's even paused. How are, you, how are you calling in more people when the game's paused? Look at that. That's ridiculous. This is why I don't like Kaiser Egg sometimes. It's just... It's just so laggy. Super, super laggy. Good. Get in there. Uh, I will send... Don't send in the tanks. The motorized might be actually a little bit faster. Uh, nothing there. Cut those guys off, which would cut off all of these guys. Nonconformist regulations, good. Let's do defending the white race. With all the recent laws we've passed, we should prepare for a black backlash. It would not do to have our women and children attacked by savages. Every man needs a gun to protect himself and his family, and we need factories to make them. Once we have both a white 
brass can finally sign relief. Okay, cool. I guess we get some guns. I guess that's cool. Come on. You should be in there by now. You really should be. Good. Up out. A little bit better. Very nice. Very nice. That's good. 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 Grab some jet engines because we could use those. And. Come on, man. Seriously. There you go. Nuke him. Kill him. You're going to defend at the very end. This has been a long, long, long time coming for this stuff. Oh, and we have this stuff. Better look at this. Military occupation. No more, no less. Now for you guys, invade from here to invade Port of Spain. And then the other three, you can invade from there to there. And then we'll start invading down here. Follow Bangkok? Well, too bad for them. Very good, very good. This will save up a lot of stuff here. Alright, so let's Supply is so god awful down here. Oh, I should get some radar. Yeah, why not? We're gonna need that. I'm gonna call only half of you guys in to come on to this side as well. Chile is gone. Goodbye, Chile. Head on down here. It's gonna take some time, but that's okay. Yeah, no. Keep up the pressure, they can't retreat, so this is very good, very good for us. I hate that Africa's so independent. Oh, the Congo's looking pretty good, though. I like that. Republic of China's looking pretty good. Pretty good. Not bad, not bad at all. How much command power do we get every day? That's a good question to ask. More than one, that's pretty good. 1.08. Control the army, we can do all of that stuff. Defending that white rass. What else we got here? Uh, I, could, I could probably send you up here. Take that out because you can. I said these 13 divisions not doing too much. Alright then, let's go ahead. If, you, if they're not doing too much, might as well help them out, right? Manaus. Manaus? Maybe? Maybe not? I don't know. Uh, tank wise, how are we doing? Ladder shooting? Now it says we might be able to win. Maybe we'll try that. Let's grab some of this for more defense. Now you guys don't look like you might be able to win. Can we not nuke? We need more air superiority, which makes sense, I suppose. Northern Andes, Peru would be good. I'll send you 200 down here, and you can do some more Peru as well. And you're going to nuke the living bejesus out of them. There you go. Down here, you're going to get nuked because we can, and get nuked because you can, and then, uh, this is not too bad over here. Let's do it anyways. Very good. And who do we have a war goal on? Uh, Argentina, Bolivia, Liberia. Yeah, we don't want to go to war with them yet. We have that until November 1st of this year, huh? So within a few months, it's going to be gone. That's not good. Uh, let's see. You guys. Subs. I don't want to do this, but we could do that. Maybe, like, there you go. Head on in. They'll do that pretty quickly, hopefully. Nice. Oh, we took Lima already. Nice. Very good. That definitely helped us out. You guys are doing a great job down here. Oh, I still get any more stuff down there. That sucks. Prestige. Stuff like that. Not bad. Um, oh, they got stuff up here, too. There you go. Finish that area off. That'd be great. We're doing great. We're doing great, great, great. You guys are looking better, actually, right now. La Paz. Well, let's go to war them anyways. It's fine with me. And it looks like... How many men have we killed off? Only almost 11 million? Is that all? So these guys are now cut off, which is good. Popular Republic of Peru is gone. Well, it's so popular, then why would it capitulate to somebody? And they're dead. And you know what? These French soldiers, they're gonna die too. And I think that's a great thing. And, come on. Oh. Oh, these guys are retreating into there. That's fine. Whatever. Any more ships? No. That's a big sad. Any upgrades? He's level 5. He's finally level 5. He's, you know, luring stuff, I suppose. This guy, not so much. 
I think we might be able to take this guy off of this territory. You know, the sea region. Go ahead and re repair first. And we got another sub, so that's looking pretty lacking. So we'll do that, defending the white rice. And then black laws. The Jim Crow laws are a good start, but fail to go far enough to stop black America from overthrowing the white man from his rightful place in history. No longer will they purchase property outside their own cities, hold jobs on par with a white professional, or be represented by public defenders whom are supposed to be representing white America. The wrongs of the past will be righted. Oh boy. You thought Jim Crow was bad. Mm. Or maybe you thought it was great. I don't know. It's up to you. I'm not going to decide for you. Go right on in if you can to the pause. Well, oh, we can't nuke it yet. That sucks. Cool. So I am. Y'all do that. There you go. Just in case. Araquipa. Araquipa. Huh. Well, can we do this finally? Yes, Amazonas. You definitely need more stuff there. Yes, build that up. More radar. More radar. More radar. Paraguay's gone. You guys are just kind of hanging out, having a good time. Actually, if you guys took this air territory, could you actually just, you know, win? Is that possible? Nah, you guys, y'all dum-dums. So, alright. Ah, they finally showed up, eh? And you still can't win, huh? Pathetic. Oh, Jeb. You could have been great. You could have been great. A great general. Oh, you guys actually made it down here, huh? The Penal Act. So, while the 13th Amendment made slavery illegal throughout the country, this was a little more than a show of force by a group of radicals to subjugate the South. It was never part of the original Constitution. As such, the 13th Amendment has been repealed to the applause of NDWL delegates. However, to only bring back slavery would be too difficult and unpopular among all but the most hardline NDWL factions, and as such, a new order signed off on by the President has increased the sentence time for moral crimes and provided for more use of indentured labor in industry, thus being named the Penal Act, something which was far more palatable to the population. This penal labor, labor has been given boosts by a reviving of various black codes of boisterous speeches clan representatives deliver on the radio celebrates his defense of white Protestant morality. Do your time. Wow, we lost quite a bit more stability, but then again, at this point, I don't care about stability. Alright, so with you guys, y'all, we'll just head on over here or something. I don't know, it doesn't really matter to me. We got a lot to get rid of, so. Did we get that? Yes, we did. Go and hold, and here we go. These guys are looking real weak. Georgetown. More coffee, please. And there you go. I guess you can send one more if you really wanted to. Uh, go right there. There you go. Got to start branching out a little bit more of here. Ooh, another sub? No, that's what appears to be pretty good. Well, we might not need this or this anymore, maybe. Especially if you start branching out just a wee bit more. Not bad. We don't have that many subs to deal with, so do that to area two. Oh boy. Oh, we got probably got to invade there too. Um, one, two, three. Well, we don't have anything there. Anything? Ah, uh, you guys could probably come up not there over here, perhaps. That might be a bit extreme. Uh, we can't do that since we need to increase our... This thing. Half tracks? Cool. Got some marines, maybe. I don't know, I'm using just infantry, but whatever. You know, it is what it is. Tanks, how are we doing? Do we need any assistance? Yes, we do. Now, why can't we nuke? Oh, we have no one in range. Yep, let's rectify that. Y'all are fighters. There you go. And we'll do American Emperor. Standard for the various old Democrats to stop fussing around and recognize that the head of the National Democratic White League is the chief executive of the United States of America. With the American Savior Act, all remaining white leagues, the ODP will register with NDWL and all white Americans will register to birth. The president and American Emperor of the Invisible Empire shall also be gifted total say in all legal matters. Yeah, I guess the Constitution's gone. It is what it is, I guess. 
Black Education Act. The way the public education change is implemented, implemented by Simmons, in order to solidify Christian identity into the youth of America is nearly complete. This final act, which passes with unanimous support and approval by delegates, is a Black Education Act. The Black Education Act totally redefines education practices for ethnic minority communities and, in particular, African Americans, notable for it to make it illegal to teach education to African Americans divorced from their role as laborers, distance them from older notions of religious unity across races, and slashes already minor public spending on black schools. As part of the speech denouncing the law, or announcing the law, Simmons stated there is no place for the Negro and the Anglo-Saxon community and above all the level of labor. What is the use of teaching the Negro mass ch Negro child mathematics when it cannot use it in practice? It's for the best? Wow, I hope I can monetize this video someday. <laughs> Alright, well, whatever. It is what it is. I, not, not, not much else I can really say about it. It is what it is. Oh, what's going on? Oh, we started sinking some stuff down here. Ah, oh, German convoys, good. Good, good, good. There's a lot of things around here. Hopefully we'll do okay. Alright, get out of that battle. Seven more guys. Excavation three. Let's go with excavation two, because even though we need... Actually, we don't need any more chromium. We've got enough now. Great! Great, great, great. Supply-wise, it's god-awful down here. If you, need, if you guys can go, go right ahead. We're sinking a lot of things around here, which is awesome. This has to be addressed as well. Oh, Bolivia, thank you. Could have popped a deed to you, but I don't really care. Go in, go in. Hey, what are we missing? Oh, yeah. Dreadnoughts, better tactical bombers would be nice. Get level 3, get even more range. Not bad, pretty good. Goodbye, and replace it with that. Mechanized, mechanized 3. Any other planes? Anything else here? No, no, no. Any more things around here? Lots of convoys. And some, some destroyers, too. Nice. And more infantry, thank you. And what do we have? Mexico, Five of the Republic. I don't know why they're still there. There you go. Not bad. Not bad if I do say so myself. I'm glad Argentina's actually at war with them. That makes it actually much nicer for us. Hopefully we can take out this top pretty easily. Lots of convoys against them since we upgraded our we upgraded our, you know, naval doctrine. We've also got some more upgrades for just sub stuff anyways. Ooh, that is not good. As long as they can't find us, that's important. Oh, our carrier is getting involved. Sink those destroyers trying to sink our subs. How dare you? Nope. Hey, we landed. Nice. Send one guy down there. And send one other guy to link up over there. And send one guy to go right down there. Oh, getting them dreadnoughts involved. Very good. Ah, oh, sink them shippies. Beautiful. So these guys should have already capitulated. I mean, they don't have that much in terms of industry and such. So... Hey, not bad. Go, guys, go, 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 go. Do they even have a capital anymore? They don't seem to have a capital. Go, go, go. Force the attack. Ah, there they go. Finally. Union of Amazonas is. Oh, these guys are gone. That's good. You guys sit down here. Shatter them. That'd be great. Great, great. We got more nukes. Well, we'll just nuke that. No, we can't do that. Darn it. That? No. We get maybe get some better strategic bombers, actually. Oh, uh, can't nuke that either. How about over here? Yeah. There you go. There you go. That's gotta be god awful. First of all, you're fighting in the jungles of, of not Africa, but the Amazons. And then. You get nuked. Like, that's gotta be just. just terrible. Do it again. Ah, uh, now that feels good. God. Ugh. Oh. Jungles. Why do we fight in them? Are we just here to suffer? A little bit. Although we did a great job in naval invading, though. Mm, get down there. Come on, move, move, move. Move those chubby little American legs. And let's do contract leasing. The time has come for those who have taken from society to finally give back. Our National Prison Administration will begin coordinating with the national government approved companies for contracts that will contribute to the common good, starting with the mass infrastructure. With the introduction of the black laws, we should not suffer a shortage of prisoners. Wow. And as usual, it is what it is. Ah, good. 
I'm going to send you guys up that way. This should help capitulate them a little bit faster, actually. Union of... We're fighting these guys, right? So, where are our soldiers? I don't know. Just nuke the capital because you can. Down here, we got in circle. Lots of crap. Yeah, no. Oh, I don't want to lose any tanks. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh, yeah, we got a lot of guys around here. That's good, that's good. Nuke this again. No, wait, we can't nuke that again. Darn it. Oh, you guys, what are you up to? Just rush, 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 rush. And uh, you guys, right here. And we can go in whenever you can. Great, great. We got a lot of political power, too. I'm already 25 minutes into this video. I swear, man, sometimes when you're enjoying things, they just time just goes by so fast. Oh, we save these guys, so that's good. We nuke this guy? Yes, we can. Thank you. The Japanese have shown up. Well, that's a bad idea. Hope you like radiation, Japan. Because that's, that's what you're going to get for Christmas. Because it's literally December 23rd right now. 24th, I don't know. Doesn't really matter. More ships. Ah, oh, we're doing such a good job over here. I love it. What do we just get? Ah, oh, yes. Give it some more transports. Good. Advanced landing crafts. Might as well, right? Any more ships? Nine, yes. That's the case. Go right there. You five, go ahead and fill out some more of these lines. Looking pretty good, Halsey. Minesweeper layer, that stuff is okay. Is there anything else here? No. He's level five still. Not bad, not great, but not bad. Convect leasing, great. Wickedness of Eve. It was a woman who defied God and is a way of women to lead men down churchless road. And no, Alma White, you may not be a preacher, dancer, or voter. For we will defend white womanhood even from itself. Alright. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to comment. I mean, I can. But I don't, I don't feel like it. You know, I don't. Guys, there, so many guys here. Can't nuke a lot of these provinces, which really sucks. Have we invaded the islands yet? Not yet. Oh, what's going on here? Pull out, pull out from that. I said pull out. Hmm, whatever. More submarinos. There we go. Ah, Paratinas capitulated. Nice. You guys, you guys keep on going. We're going to try to do the best we possibly can to build up some real roads here, but oh my goodness, it is god awful. Um, oh, there's these guys. If we can, we will. Nuke, nuke, nuke. Ah, Bahi has gone too. Very nice. More tanks. Don't mind if we do. Ah, uh, combo song. That sucks. More enemy sunk. 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 That is very good. Very, very good. Keep going, guys. You're doing a great job, even though there's a lot, a lot of resistance and such around here. It doesn't help that I'm nuking all over the place. Yeah, no one likes it when you nuke. Disgusting. You get it all over the place. Yuck. Marines 2. That'd be good if I actually used them. Marines 3. I apologize if you wanted to read that. Eh, whatever. Christian identity. American Britain are ruled by descendants of the Manasseh and Ephraim, and their prophecies to usher in a new kingdom of God. Yet some churches still do not do this this way. We will endorse Christian identity as a state religion with the Holy Church of Zion as a state church. Tax breaks will be offered to denominations that shift towards this view. Cool, I like tax breaks. What do you know I like prefer I prefer over tax breaks? Not paying taxes. There you go. Cool. If you want to bomb stuff like enemy radar and planes and anti-air and such, that's fine with me. I don't really care. Over here, well, burn. And the holy light of our Christian identity? Oh, man, this is this is nice. It's kind of warm. Then again, I think Brazil is already warm to begin with, but you know what? We're just reaffirming the warmth of Brazil. 
It's a lot of bombs. Just as God intended. You know, Guajara has capitulated. Awesome. Get the barnacles out of here. Nice. Five more. Oh! Nice. You guys go right there because you're looking a little lacking. Oh, level 9 attack. Skill 9 attack. Not bad. Not bad, Reno's, if I do say so myself. Skill 15. There we go. Do we take this yet? Oh, guys, come on. How are we not taking it yet? These guys are all surrounded. Oh, there, there's no more guys in there. Wait. We can't enter provinces. Um, I don't believe you. But whatever. All right. Don't do that one yet. This is not good. Um. Well, I guess you're not going to do it jack squat, are you? Come on, let's go, 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 go. Oh, is that Argentina? Oh, that is the Argentinian stuff. Christian identity. Cool. Let's grab some of this. We're done with our naval doctrine then. Awesome, my friends. So we're done with this. We're done with all this. Oh, divergent Christian thinking and Christian identity. The Holy Church of Zion has done its best screen for religious beliefs when recruiting, but now our new recruits often propagate beliefs we do not fit the Simmons Armstrong line. One group cut in out in California called Mankind United claims that America's Savior is a local minister. Another has insinuated that the government is willing to assist Catholic nations in their liberation. The potential threat to our power is limited, but at the same time, this unity breeds contempt. The elders of Zion are divided as to which one of these ideas are dangerous enough to stamp out. What do we do about these outrageous claims? Let innocent lies rest. Wickedness must be stamped. Wickedness got to be stamped out. And Christian critics. Christian Protestant leaders are not enthusiastic about adopting Christian identity as its tenets go against traditional Christian doctrine, especially the claim that the British and therefore the Americans are the true descendants of the Jews. Brown and Southern Baptists, such as Lee Rutland, and Scarborough and Monroe E. Dodd have written papers refuting our stance on specific doctrines despite admiring some of our views. Perhaps we should pressure the SBC to be in more line with the beliefs, just pay off the preachers who convert. Order them not to publish critical papers. Combination of payoffs and bans will do the job. You bet it will. There's so many focuses. Let's go ahead and do our Marine Corps. The Marine Corps was the epitome of the American power projection around the globe. From the shores of Tripoli to the halls of Mont Montezuma, the Marines were always there. We should ensure they have the modern equipment and training. Oh god, we got several. That's not good. You know what's worse than getting encircled? Running out of coffee. Which we, which I just did. Oh, I know. It's so bad. So bad. One of the weird times I'm actually going to say or be thankful for Argentina. And then again, they're doing a great job, but... Sometimes it pays having allies, or at least having a strong enough industry where we can do stuff like this. So we gotta mop all this up. Obviously, we're not gonna have a peace deal with the uh, on, on Third International. I don't really care. I just want to kill all these guys off and have all the Americas under us. That was, that was my main goal this entire time. So go ahead, move on in, have a good time. Because if you're not having a good time, why do it? Hmm. Very nice. Let's straight and move in there. Looking not too bad if I do say so myself. Dominion of Goliaths. Let's see about that. That's really not looking too bad down here. I like it. Build some more air bases though. Where we're headed, we're gonna need a lot of air bases and some more supplies. Lots and lots of building. So after the Marine Corps, we'll probably go ahead and do naval training, amphibious, amphibious. Ooh, I like this one, leg infantry stuff. We need to enlarge the Marine Corps and ensure they're able to project a power around the world. Because that's leg infantry for all urban areas. Naval training's not bad for more, uh, you know, assaulting and such, but... Hmm. Oh, we need to get some modern tanks. I forgot about that. Excavation 2, let's grab Excavation 1. There you go. Finish these guys off first, that'd be great. Vera, Vera, good. How many dead do we have in uh, terms of enemies? Only 17 million, that's all. Okay, we did pretty darn well so far, I'd say. Pretty darn well, I don't like seeing this here, so you guys are still over here, right? The Missouri Militia. Oh, there you go. Okay. 
go ahead whenever you can. More dockyards, not bad. Maybe it's time we finally upgraded these d these dudes. Level two is not great. Level four, even better death charges. There we go. That's beautiful. I don't think we'll make too many of these, but maybe we will. You never know. Food rocket engines, not bad. Let's grab level three. Even nine more ships. We're starting to run out of things to sink, so I'm going to do this, to do that, to do this, and then do that. As you can tell, I always leave my ships to do convoy raiding because I don't really care about them. They always find enemy ships anyway, so it doesn't really matter too much. Expand the Marine Corps. Not bad, not bad. Urban Warfare Training, then we'll do Semper Fod. Which is great. Actually, if that's the case. You guys just head on down here, maybe? You guys go there. There you go. That'd be good. Not bad. Go ahead in there. That would be great. You guys, even though I don't want to send you into the mountains, it'll be alright. You guys will be fine, especially if we're building up more infrastructure, so. Not bad. Not batterinos. It's good. I'll throw you throw even you guys down here too but before we go to war I'll be right back well everyone sorry about that but it's time to go ahead and do what must be done uh, radical socialists in our Americas I don't think so now we have a lot of red here but you know what that's okay because where we're headed it doesn't really matter since we've already lost basically a half a million people they've lost already 12,000 to us and frankly they're already out of manpower for the most part so we lose a few guys here and there, you know, it is what it is. Um, and they actually beat some of our soldiers too, huh? Alright, well, good luck with that. Good, good luck. Air superiority-wise, it's, it's definitely a mixed bag. It's not great in some areas, it's okay in some other areas, so. Sao Paulo, can we nuke it? Why can we nuke it? We need more air superiority. It's alright, that'll be okay. Urban warfare training, great. Let's grab some increased military spending. Civil war devastated the American civil civilian industry, but has made the... Military industry, quite a profitable enterprise. While the Civil War may be over, America still has enemies to fight and wars to win. And as such, keeping the Civil War military spending and expanding upon it is in our best interests, of course. Now, we're slowly going to lose more and more guys. We've already lost probably 50,000. But they've lost more than double our casualties so far. And they can't replace them. Which is, honestly, the most important thing here. Absolutely the most important thing. You guys go as best as, you, best as, as hard as you possibly can, Edward Amon. Go ahead and go ahead go ahead. Not bad. What, are you, what type of army are you part of? E-wing. A-wing. E-booth. Huh? Sao Paulo. I'd love to nuke it. I would love to nuke it. But we don't have any more range or air superiority yet. And we're about to cut them off. South America. What a wild place. I don't know. Maybe it's wild. I've never been. Might not ever go. Maybe. We'll see what happens. Never know what the world might hold. Except a lot of death. There you go, build a lot of anti-air. I don't think we need any more guns. I'll the equipment, just some more dreadnoughts, you know, all the casual stuff. The normal stuff. Yeah, if we can, let's go ahead. Can we nuke down here? Yeah, oh yeah, we can, yeah. Why? Because we can. Uh, Cordoba? Sounds very Spanish to me, because that is a place in Spain. Buenos Aires? Montevideo? I'm probably saying that... Oh, I might be saying that wrong. Puerto Madryn? I have no idea. Oh, any ships? Any more ships? Less than 5 million manpower in reserve, but I'm not too concerned about that. And, ooh, yeah, we've done a really good job with our Navy. Marines 3, I don't even have any Marines. Spare Troopers, I'm not even going to use them for the rest of this campaign. But that's okay. Ships are doing a great job. Oh, we have a carrier. Look at that. There you go. Be part of a new task force. There you go. And you guys, do the same thing. Be part of a new task force as well. Great. Ooh, enemy ships. Ooh, that is not good. That's alright. And we've lost up to probably 600,000. We've killed off more than two-thirds of a million, which is awesome. Enemy agent turned. Ab al-Malik ibn Uthman. Well, honestly, just from what I'm judging with our campaign and using him, it's very weird that he turned to believe in what we believe, but hey, war bonds. Funding the war effort will require more than victory gardens and volunteerism. Liquid assets are in short supply, especially with our economic programs ongoing. We can capitalize on public trust and implement war bonds as most other free nations do. 
Yes, we are a very, very free nation here. I will... Yes, very free nation. Extremely free. They have the 97 factories. Maybe we're probably roughly on 50-ish uh, guys in terms of divisions. But, you know. But, you know. Any more bombs? I love bombs. Bombs for fun. Fun bombs. Bomberinos. Bomb me daddy. Any more of these ships? More subs? Don't mind if we do. Now this guy is level 5. Skill 5, I should say. And this guy is skill 8, which is awesome. Really awesome. Africa's looking at us. Europe is looking at us. And I'm just like, well, I don't think they can really invade us. And that's a fine thing with us. That is totally okay. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, we lost a convoy. Oh, did they catch us? Oh, they might have actually caught us. That's not good. Are our guys... Oh. Where are the divisions that are supposed to be doing this? Oh, you're just kind of hanging out. Well, that's stupid. Wycliffe Draper, you've done a great job for us, but... Honestly, I'm about ready to court-martial for you for what you've not done here yet. Good. Oh, six more Greek destroyers. Not bad, not bad. Come down here, help take him out. Very good. Advanced rocket engines. Well, we can go ahead and grab some more stuff here. No, we're done with that. Let's grab some of this. Better hydrophones? Might as well. Tanks, how are we doing? How are we doing? Doing a pretty good job, I'd say. Uh, how much longer is this war going to last? Oh, we've cut off almost half, one and a half million. Not bad, not bad. You guys. Keep moving in, keep moving in. It's just going to take a little bit of time to get rid of all these guys, of course. Force the attack, I don't want them to live. Good. I've lost quite a few guys. 1.7-ish million. Not bad. War bonds. Help with some new arms factories. With a larger army that can re recruit across Colombia, we need arms that can support, them, support their needs. Spending on and working with managers of military arms factories is an obvious solution to this. Absolutely. Buenos Aires. Oh, Argentina. I'm glad you helped us out in taking out our enemies, but... I would say that they were pretty much just useful idiots, to say the least. Come on, can we hit 2 million losses for the Socialist Republic of Argentina? I would really like that. I think everyone here would like that. Well, maybe not. Maybe unless you're Argentinian. Then that would really suck. But oh well. Come on, I just want to nuke it again. Please, please. I'm a nuke, nuclear, ha nuclear happy? Hmm. Individual. Excavation, let's grab some more rubber. Because we can. Alright, it's almost done. We don't have enough nuclear reactors, of course. We only have 59, 78, okay. We make a nuke every five days. Not bad. Uh, at this point, it's, it's getting a little too dangerous for us to nuke, just because we're taking things over so quickly with our tanks, which I love, love, I love tanks so much. But I love helicopters, especially in TNO, so. And, the war's pretty much over at this point. Well, at this point, it would be just a nuclear cold war between us and pretty much the rest of the world. Oh, also, I guess, did Russia win? The Russia, Russians won against the Japanese, so. It is what it is. I thought it would be over by now. There they go. Thank you, Argentina. We appreciate that. Unfortunately, I don't really feel like taking out everyone else in um, Europe. That just, that would drag on this campaign. And now I want to get started with some more new stuff. But, before we finish up here, we have new arms factories, new weapons designers. If you like to read about this, go right ahead. We've got some army bonus bills as well. Right here. As well as the new army goes rolling along. I like I really like that hat. So those are those last refocuses. Everything else I think we've done. Oh, we haven't done some for five, of course. But there's Armor America Rules of Ways. And that's pretty much it for the focus tree. So hope you enjoy this campaign, guys. If you did consider, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe for you. Oh yeah, like the campaign for the amount of fun times we had with all the different people. Uh, like I said, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. I'm not sure what happened here with the Ukrainians, but I'll see all of you in a different campaign tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.